In this video, I'll be providing you with five ways to fix Fall Guys not opening. So let's get right into it. Now, the first way is pretty simple and it is one of the basic ways. So you need to have your Epic Games client here. Now, as you can see here, we have our Epic Games client. You need to navigate the library and locate Fall Guys. Now, in order to verify, you need to tap on the three dots and click on manage. And as you can see here, we have a few options. We could also ensure that auto update is enabled. So um, Fall Guys automatically update the files. Then we'll click on verify. This is the first step in order to fix the Fall Guys not opening. So as you can see, it is currently verifying the files. Let's give that some time to actually finish. All right, so now upon verifying the files, you'd simply launch Fall Guys to see if that fixes the issue. Now, if that does not fix the issue, the next fix for Fall Guys is to add Fall Guys to the game mode on your computer. Now, typically Windows computer has a game mode. You'd simply need to go to settings or the Windows options and type game mode. As you can see here, we have game mode settings, game mode, turn on game mode. So you need to enter that game mode is on. Then you need to tap on graphics settings. And we need to ensure that this is set to desktop app and select browse. Now, upon browsing, let's actually go back. You'd need to tap on your C drive. You'd need to locate program files. Then you'd need to locate Epic Games and Fall Guys. Now, upon locating Fall Guys, we need to add two things here. Well, actually three things. We would need to add the Fall Guys client, the Fall Guys client games, and the Fall Guys Easy Anti-Cheat Launcher. So let's add those. So Fall Guys Client, let's add. Select Option and set it to High Performance and Save. Let's add another one. The Fall Guys Client Game, Options, High Performance and Save. Let's add the last one. Fall Guys EAC Launcher, Options, High Performance and Save. So doing this will actually run the game in a higher performance. So ensure that game mode is on and set those in the option here so let's close out of that so that is the second option now if that does not fixes the game um what you could do next is to actually set the compatibility mode for the fall guys launcher and the epic games launcher so you need to navigate your local disk select program files and you need to locate epic games um a launcher engine binaries and depending on the the version of your computer you could either select the 32 bit or 64 bit currently running the 64 bit so you need to select 64 scroll all the way down and locate epic games launcher and you need to right click select properties then from properties you need to locate compatibility and set this to run in compatibility. It will be like this on default. So you need to select run this program in compatibility mode and ensure that Windows 8 is selected and run this program as an administrator, apply and OK. So this is for the Epic Games launcher. The next step will be to go back to your C drive. Then this time we will go to program files. Then we would need to locate Epic Games as well and then Fall Guys. Now, upon locating Fall Guys, as you can see here, we have a few options here. You need to select the Easy Anti-Cheat Launcher, right-click, Properties. You need to just re repeat this step for the Easy Anti-Cheat Launcher. Run this program and as an administrator. Run it as compatibility for Windows 8. Apply and OK. And also, the Fall Guys Client Game. Select Properties, Compatibility run as windows 8 as an administrator apply and okay so this is the third fix and if this does not fix the issue with for you um the next fix would be to actually set this as high performance from the task manager so you need to do this whenever you're launching fall guys so let me actually turn down my volume a bit so whenever you're launching fall guys you need to actually right click on the task manager here and let's give that a few seconds now when the fall guys begins to appear here now as you can see here we could select right click and go to details 
Now from details, we have the Fall Guys EAC launcher here. Right click and set the priority. Set it to above normal and select change priority. So basically that would increase the amount of RAM dedicated to Fall Guys while you're trying to play. And if you're having issues when you set the compatibility to Windows 8, you could go ahead and revert that settings if that caused your game not to launch. You could go ahead and just revert the compatibility settings and the run as administrator from there. So this is the fourth fix for Fall Guys. The final fix would include you updating your graphics driver. Now the last step would be to update your drivers. You could simply do this by going to the start icon, hover over the start icon, right click and select device manager. So identify device manager and launch device manager. And from here, what you'd need to do is to navigate to the option that says display adapters. Here you'll be greeted with your graphics driver. You'd simply need to right click and select update driver. And you could browse from your computers, but I'd recommend you to search automatically. So this is basically telling me that I have the latest graphics driver installed for my computer. Now, chances are that you might have an update. You could simply just search for updated drivers on Windows Update. And this will launch Windows Update and automatically start searching for the latest graphic driver. So I hope one of these fixes actually got you to, to run Fall Guys. So I provided five fix and if any of these fixes aren't working, you could simply revert them before doing the next fix. So I hope this was helpful and it got you to play Fall Guys and it got you to actually enjoy this game. So thank you for watching. Hacker Triple Seven out.